In the modern world, a lot of people have psychological problems because of the pressure from study and works. Therefore, a lot of doctors are trying their best to treat this kind of psychological problem. One powerful method is music. Today, our project is to test the relationship between the heart rate and the music. First, we should use the index fingers and middle fingers. Then, put these two fingers onto the person's wrist. Third, press these two fingers slightly until you feel the beats of the artery. Finally, you can count the number of beats for 15 seconds and multiply the number by 4. Material 1. Volunteers. We have selected 10 volunteers. Five of them are male volunteers, and five of them are female volunteers. They mainly include our classmates, safeguards, and also our relatives. Material 2. We have an MP3 player and a headset. And also we have a timer. Let's have a look at the results of our five male volunteers. The average heart rate of five male volunteers are higher in fast music condition and lower in slow music condition. However, we can still see some deviations in male 3 and male 4. In general, our results are consistent with our hypothesis.
Next, here are the results of our five female participants. Similarly, the average heart rates of five female volunteers are higher in fast music condition and lower in slow music condition. However, we can still see some deviations in female too. In general, we can conclude that the results satisfy our hypothesis. After we see the result, we found that there are several problems. For example, here, F2, all the three numbers are very close. Why? Why this kind of the deviation happens? We need to make clear the reason of the deviation. The first problem is our accurate heuristic problems. In our experiment, all the person we test have different characteristics. For example, some people are just 20 years old, and the other are 65 years old. As we all know, young people are more affected by the music, especially the fast music, because they are quite excited. However, for older people, they are quite conservative. So, of course, they will not be affected so much by the fast music. This is of the first reason, I think, why the deviation happened. The second problem is the music problem. Before our experiment, we don't have very rigorous definition of fast music and slow music. Different people will have different considerations. So that makes our result unfairly. Before I show you the third problem, first I want to do a very small experiment. Let's go. Can you test your house? Okay, now after five minutes rest, right, uh, let's test this person's pulse again. Let's go. I have tested this person's pulse twice. One is before the exercise and the other one is after the exercise. And I found that after the exercise, his pulse is 1.5 pounds than in ordinary states. This tells us that a lot of factors like sports can affect a person's pulse. And in our original experiment, we have no idea what the volunteers have done before the experiment, and this will make our experiment result not so complete.